Welcome back, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for taking the time and spending a little time with me. I always appreciate that. And before we get started with the video, don't forget, hit that subscribe button, cut on your notifications, and hit that like button. Now, stay tuned for your feature presentation. All right, so here we are, guys. Week six, man, taking on the Kansas City Chiefs. And as most of you guys probably know, yes, I'm still on vacation, but still putting in that work. I'm in Cabo, in the hotel. But hey, man, you know, whatever background noise you hear, you got to excuse that. But like I said, man, I'm still putting in that work, trying to give you guys something to look at uh, in the meantime, in my spare time, before I go off and do my thing with the family and all. And as you can see, look at this, man. Travis Kelsey trying to boogie on us right there, trying to get themselves hyped for the game. As we take a look at Patrick Mahomes here, 1,100 yards, five, uh, five touchdowns, eight interceptions. Looks like rookie numbers right there. And here he is rolling out on first down and makes a rookie mistake. He throws it across his body, and just like that, Terrell Edmonds comes up with the interception. I got to give myself some credit there. As you saw, I was using control in him. But the rookie safety comes up with his first career interception for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Beautiful stuff right there. But I don't know what Patrick Mahomes is doing. I guess that explains why he has now nine interceptions on the year. First and ten, Pittsburgh Steelers are going to run with Le'Veon Bell. Le'Veon Bell gets a good pick up there. Second and two. They're going to hand it off to Le'Veon Bell. And right up the middle, he's running and rumbling and bumbling, running over people. I don't know who that white guy is, number 22, but he gets a piece of Le'Veon Bell right there. Ben Roethlisberger is going to go play action fake, and he's going to find Vance McDonald for the first down. And here they are, guys, from the 15-yard line. Le'Veon Bell sneaking around the outside, almost gets into the end zone, down to the two-yard line. First and goal, they're going to hand it off to James Conner. Nothing happens. Second and goal. Ben Roethlisberger surveying the field. He finds his man in the back of the end zone, but unable to keep his feet in bounds. And they're third and goal here. Roethlisberger is going to go across the middle and a touchdown throw to Rosie Nix as he gets down to avoid contact. That's how you want to do it, man. You come out on the road, go right down the field, score a touchdown after getting a turnover. An interception by Patrick Mahomes results into a touchdown pass by Roethlisberger to Rosie Nix. And just like that, the Steelers are up 7-0. Here come the Chiefs again, second and 14. Looks like they're going to go with the screenplay here. Oh, look at that Kareem Hunt making a guy miss. Ooh, running strong there. And able to pick up almost the first down, third and in inches. They're going to give it back to Hunt. He gets the first down. And here we are, first and 10. They're going to give it to Hunt one more time. Another little nifty run. Second and six. They're going to hand it off to Webb. He picks up a few, third and four. Patrick Mahomes is able to find his man across the middle right in front of Artie Burns there. That was a great catch. By who is that? Oh, the newly acquired Sammy Watkins. First and ten, and Kareem Hunt gets the ball up the middle. He's going to pick up about six. That was some awkward physics right there. I hope EA fixes that with the real play of motion. We'll see. Here they are, first and ten from the 29. Mahomes drops back, and he's able to find Travis Kelsey down to the 16-yard line. Oh, look at this. Beautiful running right here, an awkward formation that the Chiefs are running. Looks like a little bit of a read option type situation here. They ran it again there. And here it is, third and goal from the one-yard line. Mahomes is going to drop back. Oh, but he gets sandwiched by two Pittsburgh Steelers. Looks like Anthony Ciccolo was in on the mix. Yes, he is, along with T.J. Watt. And that is going to end their opportunity of getting a touchdown, but they do get the field goal. It's 7-3. Here come the Steelers again. Handing it off to Le'Veon Bell. Picks up two yards. Second and eight. Le'Veon Bell running nifty right there. Getting the first down. First and ten from the 38. Roethlisberger is going to drop back. He finds Juju on that beat. Juju Smith-Schuster picks up nine yards. It's a second and ten. And, oh, I mean, second and inches, I mean. But look at this. Roethlisberger goes down. He had a man wide open across the middle. Here it is, third down. He's going to air it out and throws it too far for Antonio Brown. Good solid coverage right there by the secondary. The Steelers are going to have to punt it away. So it is now 7-3 still. And here come the Chiefs right before the half trying to drive down the field. First and 10. He's going to hit Kelsey for about six. Second and four here. Mahomes doesn't know what he wants to do. He takes off and runs. Oh, but he fumbles the ball. And look at this. He turns it over. Mike Hilton is able to recover. And let's go back and look at the replay to see who got that huge hit. We got to take a look at this. 
Who got that hit right there, guys? Let's see. Who was it? Ooh, Vince Williams knocking the rookie around. And that's two turnovers just by Patrick Mahomes, man. You know, uh, Andy Reid can't be happy about that. His rookie quarterback looking very suspect in week six. And here come the Steelers. Roethlisberger tries to air it out to Antonio Brown and again can't keep his feet in bounds. So that connection is not going yet. They're going to run the screen pass. Le'Veon Bell's able to pick up the first down, first and 10 from the 34, about a minute left on the clock. And there goes Antonio Brown able to get it going right there. In man coverage, beats the man coverage. First and 10 again. Oh, look at this. Roethlisberger throws it back shoulder to James Washington, and the rookie makes the catch on the three-yard line. It looks like the Steelers are ready to score once again. They're going to pitch it out to Le'Veon Bell. He gets it down to the two. Oh, they try to do play action fake right there. Ben Roethlisberger gets sacked, but on third down, he is going to find Jesse James. Takes a big hit at the goal line, but he gets into the end zone. And just like that, guys, with nine seconds on the clock, Big Ben Roethlisberger is able to get his boys back in prime position, get a touchdown right there, and they have one second left. And look at this, look at this. What is Terrell? Oh, what is Terrell? What? I can't even say it. What is Terrell Edmonds doing, guys? Dude, did you see this? What was Terrell Edmonds doing? Rookie mistake. We're going to look at the replay, but look at this. It's almost like he looks for the ball and then he loses it. And they let one of the fastest men in the NFL streak down the field for a touchdown right before the half. And as you can see, guys, it's 14 to 10. But the Steelers have the ball here again starting the second half. Roethlisberger able to pick up the first down. They're going to hand it off to Le'Veon Bell. Le'Veon Bell picks up another four. Handing it off to Bell again. Oh, he gets sandwiched inside. Only picks up a yard. If that... And look at this, Roethlisberger able to go deep, looking for Juju Smith-Schuster, unable to catch it. But there is a flag on the field, and that normally means there's some type of interference. Absolutely, pass interference on the defense. And that's going to keep the drive going. Here come the Steelers on the 37-yard line. Bell gets nothing, second and nine, play action fake. Roethlisberger, oh, able to sneak it in to Juju Smith-Schuster across the middle to catch the ball down on the 15-yard line. Mike Tomlin shows his appreciation there. Here goes Ben dropping back again. And look at this. You knew it wouldn't be long. There is Antonio Brown for another touchdown. And ben Roethlisberger is really heating up, guys. He has three touchdowns on the day if you've been keeping track. And it is now a 21-10 lead. And Patrick Mahomes again showing his rookie mistakes right there. Overthrowing his man who had, had the first down. Finds his guy right here to keep the drive going. First and 10 from the 47. He's going to go play action fake. And look at this. Awkward looking animation right there. Second and 10. And Mahomes is able to find Watkins again for the first down. So they're driving on the 36-yard line. They're going to hand it off to Hunt. Hunt picks up two. Second and eight with the empty set. And Travis Kelsey is able to muscle his way down. Third and two. And look at this. Who is Mahomes throwing it to? Who is he throwing it to there? And, this one is right down and once again, man, the drive stalls, but they're able to get a field goal. It is now 21-13. 40 seconds or so left here in the third quarter. And as we get to the fourth quarter here, they're going to hand it off to Bell. Bell gets nothing. They're already in a third and 11. Roethlisberger drops back, tries to find the tight end across the middle, but look at that outstanding coverage. By Eric Berry. Look at this. You can't play it much better than that. Vance McDonald never had a chance at it. Excellent defense there. So the Chiefs have a chance here. They start off running with Hunt. Second and five. Oh, Holmes is going to drop back. Oh, he, oh, he's in trouble. He fumbles again. He fumbles again. Look at this. <laughs> Did you see that? I mean, that ball was going all over the place, man. I love the ball physics, but come on, EA. Y'all got to do a better job of replicating that. You know that. The fight for the fumble right there. That looked kind of crazy. But anyway, as you can see, man, Chiefs were unable to do anything with that. Got themselves in a hole with that fumble. And now the Steelers have the ball again. And we're just going to try to run out the clock here, man. Le'Veon Bell getting some work. First and 10 from the 32. They're going to hand it to Bell once again. And Jesse James didn't get that block. Could have possibly been a touchdown. Oh, look at this. James Conner able to cut it outside. Great read by the running back right there. Down to the 8. They're going to hand it off to Conner again. He almost gets in the end zone. Second and two, they're going to pitch it out to Connor, and Connor is running hard, and they reward him 
and he gets in for the steal a touchdown right there. James Conner definitely, definitely deserved that touchdown right there. I'm glad that the offensive coordinator decided to go back to him, feed the beast. He breaks a tackle and gets into the end zone. And looks like the Steelers are running away with this one, man. 46 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. And look at this. Mahomes tries to go deep. Last chance at trying to get ahead of the Steelers. Can't come up with the play. And just like that, the game is over. So once again, man, the Steelers are victorious. It's going to take them to 6-0. 28-13 is the final. And, you know, we're getting close, man. We're getting much closer to Madden 19. You know, I don't know how long I'm going to continue, you know, with this. And you guys seem to enjoy it. So as long as you're enjoying it, I'll give you something here to look at as we wait for the next game. we got a lot of information starting to roll out now. By the time you see this video, or perhaps a little bit after that, the uh, EA will probably have released their gameplay deep dive definitely going to do a video on regards to that as well i will try to say maybe tomorrow um you know doing a lot of excursions and stuff like that here today in cabo so i can't promise that i'll be back today uh, but i definitely want to give my thoughts on the deep dive and then of course ea plays right around the corner and there you have it all right so that's going to do it guys if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to the channel cut on your notifications hit the like button and we'll catch you in the next video all right that'll do it for now but until next time let me know what you think. Peace.